We all have a story to tell. We each bring a wave of lived experiences and lessons learned. We are all influencers. Let's not miss the point in which entertainment enters you. Be mindful of what you watch. You see these people on reality shows being someone they've always wanted to be. Could it be a lifetime calling? Or could it perhaps just be an email that pops up on your phone one morning? So fam, not too long ago I entered onto a competition to get on a show Influence Me TV. Welcome to Influence Me Reality Show Global Casting Call. This is your life-changing TV deal and In a city where most come with a past, a history in your books, a story to tell. We almost all want to be influencers. In order to compete in this competition to get on the reality show, you had to create an account on this website called Orbit. I guess you were able to pay to vote, and it didn't require an account for that. It just required your card info. So then I started being a little more skeptical. So upon doing some internet digging, I found that the producer and the founder of the show is Nader Nababi. The face is Marissa DeSero. Right now, these two are leading the way for hundreds of influencers to promote and basically add people onto this so-called casting call. Hello everyone. So I'm here uh, with you and I just leave it with you and I'm here to answer questions. Yes, so welcome everyone. We're just going to be touching base on some very common questions for Influence Me. Obviously, there is the founder. Uh, we're going to be going over some basic things, but let's just get to know him first. So Nader, how did you start this and what made you want to do Influence Me and everything like that? Yeah, so thank you so much for this live, everyone. Uh, my name is Nader Nababi. I'm the founder and one of the producers at Influence Me TV reality show. Uh, so the story is not like, you know, it's not a, like a, I woke up one day in the morning and I said, like, hey, let's decide to do this. There are two things throwing me off right now. One, I have not been able to find anywhere where they tell you how much of the proceeds go to the Jet Foundation. And two, why do they make you create an account to vote? I don't understand.